ready to strengthen and shape your arms with the ultimate eight minute toned arms workout. This is my favorite upper body routine to develop lean muscles in the upper half. It's quick, effective, and gets straight to results. If you're consistent in using this video three times per week in combination with a healthy diet and fitness routine, you will see definition in your arms and feel stronger all around. Consistency is the key to real results and I want to support you in reaching your goals. So if you're ready, willing, and committed, we can work together to get your best arms ever. So what do you say? Are you ready to get moving with me? Grab your hand weights or water bottles and let's do this thing. We will only move through each exercise one time for 45 seconds of work and five seconds of transition between movements. Choose a weight that feels challenging to complete the exercise with proper form. Start light with your dumbbells and then as you feel comfortable, progress to heavier weights. But trust me, you don't need a lot of resistance to feel work in this ultimate eight minute arms workout. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I'm Caroline Jordan, your certified health and fitness coach, here to teach you how to use movement as medicine and get the best results with at-home workouts. So if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel and consider supporting this work by becoming a Patreon member. Patreons are those that donate a small dollar amount every month to help me create more content and join me in my message of sharing movement as medicine with the planet. They also enjoy exclusive perks like my monthly workout calendar program. So join us today and get started on Patreon by clicking the link in the description box below. With all that being said, get ready to break a sweat in eight minutes and shape your upper half with the ultimate toned arms workout. It's time for the ultimate eight minute toned arms workout. Find your hand weights and get ready to start. Our first exercise is a front raise. Are you ready? I've got light weights because I know what's coming. On your mark, get set and go. Tummy tight, raise your arms up and lower down. Try to keep your shoulders away from your ears and brace with your abs. Nice tall posture. I'm so grateful that you're here. Remember, we only do each exercise one time, so you can move through the interval at a speed that feels appropriate for your current fitness level. The more you use this video, the more you'll start to know how many reps you can complete in 45 seconds, and challenge yourself to perform more reps each time you do the video and you progress. Form is the number one priority, so keep your focus on quality not necessarily speed. Rest, next exercise, side raise. You can do straight arms or bent. Out to the side, lower down. We're hitting up those shoulders. So when you're losing weight or getting in shape, the first muscle group to show signs of definition is your shoulders. So as you progress on your fitness journey, most likely someone will say, hmm, it looks like you've been working out when you're wearing a tank top because you're doing this toned arms workout. Good, squeeze your butt, stand up a little bit taller. You could, of course, do this with straight arms. Choose a variation that feels right for you. You feeling the burn? Me too. Good, keep breathing. Next exercise, rear delt raise. Hinge forward at the hips, abs tight, you raise the arms out and bring it back in. So I want you to think about squeezing between your shoulder blades, those important muscles that support us with proper posture. Engage your glutes and abs to keep a nice long spine and look out and down. Try not to look at the screen or look at me when you perform the rear delt fly. Really focus on a nice long spine. Good work. Slight bend in those elbows. You should feel the backs of your shoulders and your upper back. I'm so proud of you for being here and being consistent with your fitness. That is the secret sauce. Keep going and relax. Our next exercise is a biceps curl. So stand up tall and when you're ready, bring your biceps up and down. So if you want an easier option, 
you're doing a narrow grip. And if you want a harder option, you flip your palms towards the ceiling. Play around, see what type of challenge you need today. If you need to do a neutral or palms up version to feel the burn in your upper body. Good. How's that posture? How's your breathing? You got it. Nice and strong. So upper body bicep curl. Welcome to the gun show, baby. <laughs> what do you think we're doing next? The opposing muscle group, triceps. Elbows in, hinge forward to your hips. Use your core. Extend and bend. So I only want you to straighten and bend from the elbow. There's not a lot of extra movement going on here. And I also feel my lats. So I feel my triceps and I feel my lats to the sides of my back. Long neck, shoulders away from ears. You're doing great. I'm all about quality of movement. Form is important because we want to get stronger, prevent injuries, and improve performance. So yes, I know I talk a lot, but it's because I want you to really connect to your body and how you're moving it. <sighs> nice job. Relax, external rotation. So elbows come in. You're going to keep your abs nice and tight, open and close. This is such a good movement for the shoulders. I have another shoulder rehab video. If you haven't checked it out yet, definitely do so. We do a lot of exercises to help prevent shoulder pain. The shoulder pain is kind of a common thing, but with the right movement medicine, you can prevent it from cramping your style. So I want you to squeeze your arms at open and close. Nice job. Eight minutes, my friends, all it takes. We're getting that burn. You can do this workout more than one time though. I won't stop you. 16 minutes, 32. <laughs> All right, upright row is next. Palm faces your thigh, shoulders down and back. We go up and down. Now, depending on what size weights you chose for this workout, you are either feeling fine or you're dying. <laughs> you can go heavier as needed, but remember, it doesn't always need to be exhausting to really reap the benefits. You can just Feel a healthy challenge and see results. Good. So big upright row like you're zipping up a sweater or making a smile with your elbows. You got it. <sighs> Whew, shoulders on fire. You always know it's getting hard when you're just wishing there would be a, a bell. Let's, next exercise is an overhead press. So weights come up and we go over our head and back down. Now you can again play with palms facing your face or flipping the palms to face towards me. Lots of different ways to press overhead. Try to reach and extend the arms all the way up and down. Good, check in with your core, is it engaged? Are you smiling? Grateful for the gift to, to move your body, to be healthy, and to choose to be positive today and to move forward towards your goals of the ultimate toned arms. Yes, nice job. Keep pressing overhead and back in. My shoulders are on fire. And relax, two exercises left. Narrow row, so palms face in, hinge forward, we row and release. So now I want you to draw your weights towards your hip pocket. Again, keep your spine nice and long, looking down at the floor, and you're squeezing your back muscles as you bring the elbows back and in. I love a good row. It always makes me feel stronger and more confident, taller, better posture. <sighs> Great work, keep it going. As many reps as you can. Woo, my back is working. Nice. Next exercise, we're on the floor. So transition down to the floor safely. You're going to lay on your back and we've got a chest press. So you are going up 
and down. This is a very wrist-friendly chest exercise. I want you to press your weights all the way up towards the ceiling and bring them back down, feeling your chest and your tricep muscles. Good, you can keep your back flat on the floor, engage your core. And by now, hopefully, you haven't put dumbbells down for almost over eight minutes. So your arms should be feeling like they're ready to drop these dumbbells sometime soon. Yeah, let's keep it up, come on. Finishing strong here. Whew. And relax, place your weights down slowly come on up and we're going to do a quick little upper body stretch so shoulders roll down and back inhale up exhale down and you my friend have just completed the ultimate eight minute arms workout i hope you feel strong in your upper half and remember you want to be consistent with this video to see real results Two to three times a week is all it takes to shape those arms. So try this video for at least a month and then comment below and tell me if you see definition in your upper half. I'm Caroline Jordan, your certified health and fitness coach, and I'm so grateful that you're here on the channel. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up, subscribe, and support this work on Patreon. Thanks for a great workout, my friend. I hope you and your arms have an awesome day, and I'll see you again soon at carolinejordanfitness.com.